element C is on um, prime numbers that's two three five seven so yeah in this case if I ask to find a complement you are not relating a and b together or a and c so as far this exists this universal universal set exists you are only relating a complement with the universal set together so a complement implies since you are relating this and this together so you know what to do from this pattern that means you are trying to do universal set minus what the set a that's what complement gives you so the the um and how you pronounce it? This this simply implies that you are trying to remove a from the universal set. So let's remove a from the universal set. By the time you remove two, you remove four, remove six, remove eight. Whatever you have left in your universal set gives you the final answer for a complement. And I notice that I have one. I will have you know three is still here, four is gone, five is still there, six is gone, seven is still left there. 8 is gone, 9 follows, then 10 follows. So this is what a complement is. Do you understand that? And what if we have, um, let's say, what if I ask to find C complement, that's C prime, and now you want it. What will C prime be? C prime means universal set minus C, right? And that would give us, um, remove 2, remove 3, remove 5 and remove 7 so i'll be left with whatever i have left in the universal set gives me my final answer just like what i've done here okay but please and please 